All right, someone has a decision to make. You could be in your feelings about it. All right. It's asking you to dive deep. The oracle is asking you to dive deep. And stay positive. All right. I haven't used this deck in years. So you could be getting into things that you haven't like done in a while uh, that used to interest you, right? Yeah, there's blessings. Ooh. What? What? What's the matter? What? What is it? What, honey? Oh. Alright, let's see. What's the message? Feasting. I'm gonna read this this one. I pulled this deck out too. Um let's see if I can see it, alright? It says, let us feed upon the nourishing and be thankful for thy feast. Um, now, not here nor there, yet everywhere it be. Nor here or there, yet everywhere it be. Let's talk about the food, right? <laughs> the food we put into our systems. Uh, well, I hear that United States has like their um, grade of food that we eat is like bad. All right, it's not not very sustainable. That's the word they're giving me. All right, is it so? It's um, having enough nourishment and providing. All right, so you will have enough. It says, in ancient times, there would have been a lot of worry during the winter seasons. Your ancestors would have to conserve as much food as possible. Fearing their families would have, wouldn't have, would have enough to survive. <clears throat> when you came around, your ancestors would drink and celebrate as, as a signal of faith in the brighter days to come. Most of the modern world doesn't need to worry about having enough food. But the fear of not having enough still exists in different ways. Uh, you are being guided to challenge your limiting beliefs around scarcity. Uh, so lack. Um, you can be generous with your time and resources, knowing that you you give, knowing that what you give will be returned tenfold. Allowing yourself to give despite your concerns. Let's the universe know that you will be provided for. The more you must trust in having enough, the more the universe rewards this faith with more abundance. Oh, wow. All right. It says, do not sacrifice moments to nourish your mind, body, and soul because of fear. As you uh, confront your limiting beliefs, more, more pathways to wealth will be provided to you. So you may feel like um, you want to hang on to your money right? Um, you're saving money for a specific thing. It's like, um, maybe you're seeing that you're already getting more back. All right. It's okay um, to let go of that lack mentality. All right. Or feeling like you need to save it for a rainy day. It's like, um, those days are over. I feel like the blocks have been removed when it comes to your finances. You could have been your own block. All right, you could have been blocking yourself. Every time I spend money, I, I say um, I say something, right? I say uh, all the money I spend returns to me times 10, all right? That's a spell. It's words, right? It's a sentence that I say, but um, it puts it into the universe, okay? And it's not negative towards anyone else. It's manifesting, all right? So like say you want to go get your hair done and you're like, oh, I don't really, I don't really want to spend the money on that because I need this. It's like the universe wants you to reward yourself. This is part of your rewards, part of your blessings. Okay. All right.
even like um when you say you want to change like the way you eat but it's like um yucky food is cheaper right you, to eat healthier means you have to spend more money right do that spend, more, spend the money it's worth your health right your connection you know to spirit all right what's the message here boundaries keep boundaries in place uh, some people may want to um ask questions that you might you might not feel comfortable answering you don't have to answer anything you don't want to okay uh, grounded okay so it's important to keep boundaries in place to stay grounded all right because when people start invading your boundaries um it can throw you off mental and like mentally right in the head so if something's time Someone's trying to make time stand still so you don't move forward. That's kind of what I'm getting from this. It's like the sand is in the glass. All right. We got, it's time for your new life. Step into your power. Look. All right. This can't be stopped when it's, when divine says it's time, it's time. All right. Not a soul on the planet is going to stop that. Okay, they can try all they want. They're just going to lose their own minds trying to stop something that, that divine and the higher powers are doing, okay? Um, spirit guides. So you're being guided at this time. Trust your intuition. Your spirits are guiding you. Everybody got spirits? Someone secretly hates you. This came out the other day. It's a father figure or an ex-husband or a boss, an emperor. Or someone secretly hates that you're in this emperor energy and you're sitting pretty. They don't like that. Work with crystals. I don't know. You guys put that how it fits. You could have to work with crystals or... Could be working with someone named Crystal. I don't know. Could be a father figure. They're in co um, completion. So you've completed this cycle already. They, they're upset that you've completed the cycle with them. Okay. Or with him or with her. It can be a feminine emperor. It could be someone in their masculine energy. Okay. You're balanced. Or someone see, yeah, all right. It was some, they're working with the moon cycles, or you're working with the moon cycles. Put it how it fits. You might not even realize that you're working with the moon cycles, because I know for a long time I, I was doing things, um, subconsciously that um, now I'm recognizing that I was working with the moon cycles, right? But they could be doing this in a negative fashion because they're sociopath. Someone's a sociopath. I'm not saying this person. Listen. Okay, I feel like someone's abusing their authority and having other people monkey see, monkey do, right? Uh, people will do things for money, okay? If they are in lack mentality, they will do things to other people for money, okay? Because they don't have inner peace, all right? They didn't have any shame in this, all right? You need to cleanse your space, all right? And you're moving on. You're moving on. You're moving on from whatever this is. You got nothing to hide. You're an open book. Had to had to shuffle these. Alright. Let's see what else comes out. Stay in your own lane, and, and so you stay in your own lane. You do you do something with passion, or um, you passionately stay in your own lane. And look, it came out again. Someone secretly hates you. They're passionate about this <laughs> because you stay in your own lane. 
All right. Wow. Guidance and advice, and it says go for it on the other side. So whatever guidance or advice that you received, you, you're being asked to go for it. Someone's too negative out here. Someone's this person who secretly hates you. They're negative. They always look at the um, negative side of life. The glass is half empty, right? You're being asked to take a break, or this person is. You got true love coming in, all right? Stay balanced. All right. Let's pull these. Yeah, your material harvest is, is here. It's here. You may recognize it, or you're going to start to recognize it. Maybe you see more money coming in, or I don't know. I'm, I'm hearing God wants you to have all new everything, all right? So may, maybe look like your car is breaking down, or you're losing your home, but you're being moved. You're being moved into another energy where you're going to have all new everything, all right? Even if it's not a brand new vehicle, it's going to be new to you, right? Something that's safe that you can drive far in. You don't get stuck on the side of the road, all right? Yeah, someone's conflicted and feels defeated, okay? But you're having this new... This could even be you, or this is the person who secretly hates you because I put it right on top. Um, you're having a... Pet, so, yeah, this could be you and the... And the this could be your energy now too, right? Um, but you're getting this new spark of energy here. Passion ignited and you're moving forward positively in a positive note, okay? You're not moving forward, uh, oh, everything's breaking and I'm losing this. No, you're moving, you're keeping your mind positive or you should, okay? And it could, yeah, with making these decisions here, okay? solar plexus you're very confident in your walk with god or with divine or however you guys look at it all right emotionally withdrawn so you could have pulled back your energy to focus on your spiritual strength okay and work on your shadow or this is somebody else okay put this out good guys i'm just reading the cards when they come out Someone's having a heart chakra activation, okay? They're seeing the truth now. This is justice or judgment. This is the judgment card, I believe, 20. I could be wrong, though. Um, intuition, all right? High priestess. So you are the truth. You know the truth. You And this is causing some sort of activation with your heart, okay? Someone faced their shadow, okay? They found their strength. They know how strong they are or, or they have an idea. Okay. What else? You know. The Emperor. So there's a emperor, a father figure, or you're stepping into your power, you're going through this transformation, you're seeing clearly. Yeah, you're clear seeing with the intuition card here, all right? You see, and the truth is causing some sort of transformation within you or your masculine, whatever this is here. I'm I'm picking up this is for you, okay? I like I just want to keep these readings about you guys, all right? I get Scorpio. I got Cancer, I got Pisces, all right, Water Signs, I got Sagittarius, I got Aries, all right. Patience. You're, 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 so I feel like you guys have planted a seed and you've been patient, all right. You're getting some new um, partnerships or you're like, this is an obstacle for you these new connections here or someone tried to put someone tried to plant the seed to cause obstacles for you with your partnerships i pulled this energy yesterday so someone is trying to mess with your partnerships or they have been all right 
someone may have made a deal to with someone else to um, put obstacles in your way is what I'm also getting. Could be this emperor, this father figure that works with crystals or that you need to work with crystals to cleanse your energy of these people. Okay, yeah, balance is here. This is the justice card, okay? Balance is being restored in this situation because you held on to hope and faith, the star energy, all right? And we got um, the waiting game, all right? So balance is being restored um, because, because of these obstacles in place to make you feel stuck, all right? It's like you held on to hope and faith. You trusted in divine. You trusted in divine timing because that's out here as well, all right? And now someone else is trapped in fear about this. And they're very deceptive. Could be a cancer. It doesn't have to be, all right? We get the sun, all right? Someone is, um, someone, you, you blind someone. Your light blinds this person, okay? They are stuck and they are stuck and trapped in fear over your victory. That you don't quit or, all right? Something's been illuminated, maybe who you are to somebody, to this person here, okay? This person could be going through a transformation or you went through a transformation, all right? Someone sees the light now. All right, they could be coming towards you, but this person is is envious of you, of your transformation. This is they, they try to keep this hidden here with the shadow card behind it. All right, they try to keep this hidden so you don't recognize it, but you might still know. All right, all right, let's pull some of these. What else, please? So this is you stepping into your happiness, all right? Someone might have been envious of you. Maybe they're seeing they're seeing you differently now and they want to come towards you. Yeah, Ten of Pentacles, the Truth Sword, Ace of Swords, and the Eight of Cups. So you're receiving some sort of truth about a marriage, about a large sum of money. This could be an inheritance, spiritual or physical. This could be generational wealth. You, you're walking away, all right? Someone has clarity on this, on this family, money, whatever this is. This could be, yeah, so you're standing your ground, all right, when it comes to this. And you're having this new start here. You have many choices, options, decisions. Or someone else <clears throat> tried to cause confusion. Look at this is clarifying that. But you're it's like the ace of uh ace of wands is here. What does that say? Outpouring? I don't know. Alright. So we got 33 coming out here. That could be significant for you guys. Alright. We got the Three of Cups, the Three of um, Swords. So this, these people celebrated, leaving you confused about this money and this inheritance. Okay, they celebrated it. Dis, dis, um, they all celebrated and, and like, this was like a pact to disappoint you over and over and over, okay? And over and over and over and over and leave you burdened when it comes to money, okay? Or opportunities, whatever, because these could be opportunities as well, all right? You're receiving the truth about this, all right? Yeah, look, toxicity, the devil. Listen, if you guys resonate with my readings, the devil has been after you. This is now people in their ego for a very long time. Since you were a child, your light irritated people's demons, your psychic abilities, your gifts bothered people, okay? Yeah, it kept them up at night. Look, caused a lot of problems because you could see through the, this. You could see through this. You may have even said things like, that's not right or you shouldn't be doing it. Listen, even as a small child, Now, someone's waiting on their ships to come in because they know they were in this toxic energy here and they were trying to betray you over and over and over and over and over and they asked other people to help and they gladly helped 
for small, a little bit of money. Okay, maybe a lot of money for some of them, okay? But um, the truth is here, okay? And now they confuse as to how you stood your ground and got out of this shit, all right? Yeah, you're moving on from this. You're moving on from it. You're moving on from it. All right? Positively mo moving forward. Look, this is clarifying this. All right? It's not clarifying. I just put the card on top of that not realizing that it's the same card okay queen of cups you're starting over all right you're getting some good news it's going to make you happy all right this is coming in for you guys i got an investment here or people want to invest look this investment is going to work out really well for you okay or someone wants to invest in your nine you all right they want to invest in you they see you as an invest something positive to invest their money into or their time into or their energy into okay the lights being shown on this person here this could be you this could be how you create or how you manifest or how you um take action with things all right this could be investigation with this shit being out here like this all right all right, or this this could also be negatively like someone invested in something towards this nine of pentacles, okay? They saw you as very abundant, so they thought they were going to plant some seeds to take from you, but it's being seen. So this is this could be you shining your light, me shining the light, or an investigator, a spirit guide, okay? Because that can be a spirit guide too, right? Or you're shining the light for somebody else. Put it how it fits. Some cycle here is complete. All right, something's over. Someone, someone wants to come towards you and speak to you. They have some sort of offer for you here, okay? They wanna come in, they wanna speak. Or you could be speaking your mind about this King of Wands here, okay? I'm kinda of getting both here. This person who tried to slow you down all right, or this this is your masculine coming in here, wanting to speak to you and um, offer you something stable. All right, yeah, moving to calmer waters. Yeah, 10, look. All right. Maybe to help out, help you move, move on from something um, and heal something. Um, so someone tried to block this person from coming towards you to heal a situation or to come towards this healer here because this was upside down, this card here. The tower is here. It could be this person here, this queen of wands, all right? This person wanted to come in and offer you some sort of assistance here and someone, I don't know, had this person in this energy here feeling afraid to come towards you or... I don't know. Maybe whatever this person offered you had you in this energy, having to protect yourself. All right. Yeah, look, two of cups, nine. But this is the real energy of the situation. So whatever was said was a lie. All right. That's what I'm getting. Two of cups, nine of cups. This is like wish fulfillment. Yeah, and ten of cups. Look, and then someone was very sneaky. Someone lied on you. Look, someone lied on you. Well, your family's being sneaky out here because they know this Two of Cups is your wish fulfillment and emotionally satisfy you, all right? Yeah, there's a lot of drama surrounding this situation here. Four of Wands because of a house, a home, a platform, someone on, online here. This could be your presence online. Communication was blocked, all right? I saw the Eight of Wands in reverse. Someone had no regrets in doing this. They may have been paid to do this. Someone will do anything for money. All right. Now there's unresolved conflicts here. Judgments being called because of who, who whatever was done. Judgments being called. Okay. Now they're watching you online or, or because this was premeditated. All right. But they had no regrets in this. That pull picked this up upside down. All right. The bottom of the deck. This happened in the past or now someone's thinking about the past. Or this is a past life soulmate connection. All right. Yeah, he, this person is watching you and sees that you are the sun or that you're happy or that you would make them happy or that this is 
the way to their happiness. I don't know. Someone could be gathering information to expose something here. Also, I'm getting that. All right. Yeah, something that happened in the past is back at the bottom of the deck. <sighs> Queen of... Someone was very greedy. And when you were a child, look, something. Some greedy bitch. Something to do with when you were a child. Yeah, all right? They collaborated or whatever. Or someone collaborated with the younger earth sign. Could be a, someone who is greedy, jealous, spiteful. All right? We'll do anything for money. I'm getting that from this. All right, this is a collaboration or someone's being talked to. Like, this is my, um, someone being questioned card, okay? So, I don't know what this is. Someone could be questioning this. So, so, so maybe they collaborated to make someone else look like they were really in the reverse, all right? So, they would miss an opportunity here, all right? Yeah, so they would, they, they were victorious in this. So, whatever they tried to do, it, it worked, all right? And someone had to find their strength. All right, this could be a Leo. All right. Yeah, our thing. Look, balance is being restored. Someone had to regain balance of their emotions and stuff uh, and went through this transformation. All right. Or someone tried to put an end to this earth angel here. Yep. By holding back and keeping them trapped in their head. Look. Or it's holding on to finances. This could also be financial abuse, okay? So, it could be financial abuse. Keeping someone trapped, holding on to their money, holding them back from growing in any way. All right? Yeah, high priestess. You know the truth. All right? You know the truth. All right, I'm going to pull some. Um, I don't really like to go over 30 minutes because then it's like a two-parter. So, I'm going to um, pull... Um, Everything in, in bags and stuff. It's just it's a lot. I don't know where anything is. <laughs> oh, it sucks. It's really hot in here too. All of a sudden. All right, let's see. So this is the truth about this inheritance. Okay, that's this is what's coming out for somebody. Oh, oh, look, eternal love. Someone got in the middle of a union here, all right? The situation's already been resolved. Oh. We got, you and your loved ones are safe and healing energy work, okay? So you could be healing your energy, your astral, your body, your, um, I don't know what the, all the terms are, but your energetic body as well, okay? Your insides, your, your health. All right, what's at the bottom of the deck? Your inner guidance is real and trustworthy. All right, guys? I'm going to leave this right here. I'm going to um, upload this, and then I'll do another one, okay? Yeah, there's only 32 minutes on this anyway. All right, I love you guys. Thank you for being here.